hey guys welcome back in the last lecture we created resource in our application for the posts and now in this lecture we will do a little stuff with the pran gem so we will install the pran gem and allow users to download the post in pdf so let's start with it first we need to create a member action for downloading the post to, as pdf so first open your routes.rb and in the routes.rb you need to define a member action for the post to download the pdf so routes.rb and in the routes.rb what you need to do here that in the resources post just add a do and block and into the blocks you need to create a block for the member defining the member route so member do and now in this member block what you need to do you need to define an action that is download okay so what this will do that this will define a member action and we know that every member action required the resource id okay so now what we need to do we need to implement this download action or define this download action inside our posts controller so open the posts controller okay so in the posts controller I'll just come at the bottom and after the destroy action you can define the uh, download action so def download Okay. and since this is a member action so we need to uh, set the post uh, before action for this download action as well so we can define this download action into the before action filter here so let's uh, paste the download here okay now what will happen that when a user will uh, send a request to this download action uh, the before action filter automatically find this post for user okay now we don't need to create a view file for this download action because we are trying to download the pdf so our request will come in the pdf format so we don't need any view file for it okay so the basic setup has been done we created the member route and we defined the member action into our controller and set it into the before action callback now what we need to do we need to add the pron gem into our rails application okay so first go to the browser and in the browser look for the gem prom so gem prom okay and now you need to add the prom gem into your gem file okay so here you can see that this is the repository of the gem file uh, gem prom and you can go to all the details about the prom here like what is prom and how it works and what it facilities it provides okay so you can go through this repository okay now come to your gem file and add the prom gem into your gem file so gem file and come at the bottom and after the css bundling what you need to do gem prom okay. paste it uh, sorry save it and come to the terminal and just shut down the server and run the uh, bundle install so bundle install the bundle install will lock the gem prom for your rails application now we need to work with the download action so just open the posts controller and do something in the download action so come to the posts controller and here in the download action you can see that since we added this into the before action callback so we are already getting the post so we don't need to fetch the post here now what we need to do that we need to define the prawn document here so we need to initialize an instance of prawn document okay so we can initialize it like a post pdf and how we can do that so we need to call the prawn document class so prawn and then document dot new okay this will define a new prawn document now the next thing is to add some text in your pdf so prawn provides the text method to display the text into pdf okay so we need to call the text method on this post pdf so we can call post pdf dot text okay so initial text that what we can provide so we can simply provide the post's title as the text here okay so we can add it's at the red post dot title okay and since we also need to display the post description as well so we can add the post dot dis description as well into the pdf that we're gonna download or that user gonna download so post pdf dot text and then here you can add at the red post dot description okay so now our text display of uh, post into the pdf that user will download has been done now we need to call the send data method which is provided by the prawn document class okay the send data method will require some arguments like invoking the pdf render method file name type 
and disposition and so on however disposition is the optional argument here not mandatory so we will not use the disposition for now okay now let's call the send data method to download our post pdf so how we can use that we can simply use send data and here first we need to call post pdf dot render post pdf dot render what this will do that this will render the pdf and allow us to download or it will render the pdf for us okay and now as the next argument what you need to provide you need to provide the file name okay file name is totally yours just like if you want to provide a file name as like uh, let's say some dummy text you can provide here but i am going to use the dynamic title here so i will use the pdfs sorry the posts title as the file name so what i will do i will interpolate the post title into the string so post dot title dot pdf okay so whatever the post title this going to be my file name okay and now as the next argument we need to provide type and the type must be application slash pdf so application pdf okay save it and uh, for now let's uh, add the word wrap so come to the view at the word wrap here here you can see that i provided this three argument that is uh, to the send data that is post uh, pdf dot render and then file name and the type application pdf okay i did not provide any disposition here we will do this in upcoming lecture okay so the task to download a post pdf in very basic and simplest form has been done at the back end level now we just need to provide user a button to download the post pdf okay however before doing that make sure that you save your routes file and you define your uh, download action as a member action into the routes okay so now we need to add the link on the browser on the view template to download this pdf so open the show.html or tr view posts and here we can provide our method to download this pdf so we can add a link here so add link to and here we can add download as pdf okay and then we need to provide the path here so what our path will be for member action the route uh, action name must come first and then post underscore path so download post path okay and here you need to provide the post instance so at the rate post okay and add the button class here so class btn btn primary and add some mt3 mb3 okay save it and now start your rail server so when you start your rail server come to the terminal sorry rail says and now come to the browser and refresh the detail page of post so here is my application and when i refresh this page you can see that i am seeing a button that is download as pdf okay now what i need to do that i just need to click on this button so let me click on this button to see whether our post has been downloaded or not so here you can see that a post has been downloaded as pdf or this post has been downloaded as pdf and you can see that it is directly downloading the pdf into my system now if i open this pdf you can see that this is the post description sorry post title and this is the post description okay so the post pdf has been downloaded in very basic and simplest form for now and this is the very basic display of post as pdf achieved using cron gem now we will do something different in next lecture like uh, here you can see that when i click on download as pdf it is direct directly downloading a pdf file into my system now in next lecture what we will do that we will allow user two options one is to preview and download and other for direct download okay meanwhile try this lecture at your end and we will meet into the next lecture till then tata goodbye take care and stay safe